Yeah. All right, Nate, what are we doing? Shoot the next testimony Tuesday. All right, let's get it. You're good, five, four. Alright guys, so welcome back to the channel. Testimony Tuesday. So this is the third Testimony Tuesday, okay? So then the last one, the last video that I posted was about stepping into freedom from the addiction of pornography. And so, just posted that, but in the last one, I kind of shared with you my walk and how I stepped into that, right? My friend, I was reading in James 5.16 about go to your brother, confess your sins, and then lay hands, you shall be healed. That was kind of the gist of it. Went there, had a dream that I was stepping into freedom. And then the next thing is walking out that freedom, right? So this is an even bigger um, task. Bro, honestly, I feel like they would have some tea. They got to have some tea. Bro. They should. It's, yeah, it's a Thai restaurant, bro. Honestly. And now we got some tea. Just let it stay for a couple minutes. Okay. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you so much. Cool. We, we got, got some tea. tea. We got yeah. some tea. All right, and cool. Let's get some tea, bro. Have like a little. Oh, it's hot, bro. Yeah. Oh wait. I'm gonna be talking to you about how to walk in the freedom from the addiction of pornography right and so pretty much had the dream now i've been i have been set free from that the bondage the slavery to that but now i have to take steps and continue to walk in that freedom and not go back on my phone and pull it up right and this is where reading and meditating on the word day and night comes into play and without doing that every single day every morning and every night you will fall back into it just kind of a, a little truth that you won't be you won't have the strength to be able to walk out in freedom without the Word of God giving you strength right and so what as so I went to my friend prayed for me received healing I'm walking in freedom I go and then there's a transition in my life where I traveled to Thailand and I think maybe two months into living in Thailand I get hit again I get hit with the temptation to watch pornography and I fall into it and I'm and I come to God I'm like God like I thought that you you know set me free but obviously like I just gave in to this temptation like does this mean I'm I'm not free right and he kept telling me like reminding me like whoever the Sun sets free is free indeed but then he started to show me that I have no strength because I didn't read the word I didn't meditate on his word day and night so I had no strength to overcome those temptations that would arise and so then he started telling me like son like you got to read the word in the morning so then when temptation comes that you are strong enough to overcome that and so I started doing that every morning I would read the word every night I would read the word and I slowly just started realizing that there was after reading the word there was like this supernatural like energy strength inside of me to overcome every single temptation that would come at me right 
And so that's how I was able to walk and continue to walk. It wasn't perfect. I slipped up every now and then and pulling it up, but I started to realize, it took me a little while to realize that my strength was secure in reading the word, meditating in his word day and night. And so kind of the idea of how you walk in that freedom from pornography.